And I think that was the point I realized the only thing I was kind of good at was video. Uh, I did horrible in school, like really, really bad in school. Um, I had like support classes, like they, they took up all my electives. Um, it wasn't until I was a junior that I finally had like my first real elective, which was the video production class. Right. Um, so I was always in like support English, support math. I was in summer school all the time cause I was just so bad at school that when I found the visual medium, it sort of made sense. Right. Um, I have a hard time like learning. Uh, I had difficulty reading, writing, all that stuff. Um, video kind of took that away. Right. There's no reading, there's no writing, it's all visual. Um, and so that kind of spoke to me uh, a little bit. Uh, so then I sort of kind of went down that path, I chose film director for my senior project, and I sort of realized, well, I think I could actually do this, and I think if I went to school for it, I would probably be pretty good at it, right? Um, so I decided at the year 2012, that's when I graduated, that I would move to San Francisco and go to the Academy of Art, San Francisco. Man, that was a mistake. <laughs> Dude, I, I, like, like almost similar to, to like my, my whole thing was, um, but like mine was, I was still more into photography at that point where I was like, okay, mm -hmm. I want to go. I, I heard about this art, like art institute, I'm like art institute. Art. I, kept, I kept on hearing it, you know, from like counselors, like, oh, have you thought about the art institute? Yeah. And I'm like, oh, let me look this up. Yeah. And like, uh, oh, they have a Sacramento campus. And I remember going to the actual campus and then giving us a tour, and like they're telling us about all this cool stuff, like making it super flashy. And yeah. Like, and like they take us to their gear vault, like yeah, like we got access to all these cameras over here, and like this and that. And then I'm like. And I, I think I already knew the answer, but I just like wanted to ask anyways. I'm like, so like, but do you still have to like take like general ed classes? And they're like, yeah. I was like, no. Nope. Yeah, dude. I don't know. Dude, but, it's it's a uh, trap, mm -hmm. right? Like they kind of show you all the potential, mm -hmm. right? It's like, cool. Here's like a cool green screen room. Here's like all the camera equipment. Mm -hmm. Look, here are a group of students who are working on a project <laughs> right now, right? And it's like, man, this is yeah. so cool. Like this is the environment I want to be in. Um, and then. I, <laughs> I I went for two years and I ended up dropping out, mm -hmm. right? Because I realized that it was still school and I was horrible at school. Um, it made no sense to sort of teach a visual medium through textbooks. That still kind of baffles me. Mm -hmm. um, I ended up dropping out 2014 and man, I guess I just somehow tumbled my way to where I am right now, mm -hmm. right? Everyone talks about like, and it's come it's becoming more common and common every day like when you hear about you know like these youtubers who who are very talented and might have gone to film school and they get asked all the time like oh is film school worth it and they're like not really but the the network and the connections you, you know are really helpful like mm -hmm. were you developing like any like useful relationships or like networks you know at your time man i i really wish i could say yes but uh, honestly i was spending all my free time um, working. So San Francisco is expensive. Um, so I was working at a movie theater on the days I didn't have school. So oftentimes where the people were networking were on set and I couldn't commit myself to a set because I was always working, uh, at the movie theater. I was an usher. I was a ticket taker. I was in the box office concessions, all that stuff. Um, and all my other classmates, they were on set, you know, working with other students and really sort of networking. Right. Uh, in my time over there, I think I was only on maybe three sets and I helped one of my friends film, I, I think two projects. Um, and so I really didn't get a lot of that networking opportunity, um, because I wanted to, you know, be in an apartment and not a dorm and I didn't want to eat really, really cheap food. Not saying that what I ate was like extravagant, but I just, I didn't want to eat ramen every day, you know? Um, so no, I really didn't get those opportunities to, to network. Like I think everyone says is the most valuable part, right? Uh, yeah, I didn't get that.